Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to change a one place decimal number into a whole number. Uh, basically that means, um, if you're not really sure, uh, we take say, let's start with a really easy one, uh, 2.5, okay, and we turn it into a whole number. Now if you uh, will recall, I have pointed out in a previous video that this is where the whole numbers are. Okay. And this is where everything else is. Okay, so this is the whole number. This is like uh, two oranges and five um, sections. Okay. Okay. So, all we're basically uh, talking about is taking 2.5 multiplying by 10 means that these digits slide to the left now over to these columns. So you have 2.5 multiplied by 10 becomes 25. Okay. And 25 is a whole number because there is nothing on this side of the decimal. Alright, so let's try uh, 9.8. 9 okay, again we multiply by 10 to make it into a whole number. We slide these digits over to the next column. Okay, so we would be left with 98. Let's try a two-digit number. Uh, let's try 30. Oop. Sorry. Let's try 37. Uh, .4. Okay, again, we multiply by 10. And these digits will slide over to the next column. Okay. Now, obviously, the 3 is in the tens column right now. All right. What column is it going to slide into? And what is our new number going to be? Okay, so I'll pause the video, I'll work that out now, and then I'll put in the answer shortly. Okay, so pause the video now. Okay, so you're taking 37.4 and you're multiplying by 10. Uh, basically, to get rid of the 0.4 and turn it into a whole number, that means that you're going to have this 3 moving into the hundreds column. Alright, which is down here. Okay. And the 7 will be in the tens column and the 4 will be in the units. Okay. And that means that your new number is going to be 374. Alright. And that's basically how you turn a one-digit uh, a one-digit uh, decimal number into a whole number. All right. I hope you found that helpful. Good luck.